can't do anything more than what these fans are to welcome Kaikata France to the UFC Octagon. Again tonight, today, he finally gets to make the walk in his home country and here in Auckland. Dig, dig, dig with that left hand goes Cut of France. That's snapping the head back as well. Good knee to the back of the leg there. Last few seconds, oh. nice elbow and a break there by Cut of France with a big right hand. Crowd respond, it's a real firefight. Nice and now a little hesitant here. Oh, nice combination work from Cut of France. Not everything landed, however, but the intentions there. That did. Searching up a cut from Cut of France. Quite astonishing given his. Oh, hello, sorry, a little wobble leg there from Lamb. He shakes his head, but he went heavy on his feet all of a sudden. Powerful low kick. Echoes around the arena. Difficult to get these, these guys with great footwork pinned down to make them feel that power and go conscious. Level change here. Nice. Lamb straight back up to his feet. He's worked well behind that. Looking for the uppercut. Great. Oh, great fight, really good fight. All three judges scored this contest. 30-27 for the winner by unanimous decision. Well, Joe, for a long time we've been, we've been looking for someone to sort of take this Canadian torch from George St. Pierre. And a lot of guys you can mention, Gavin Tucker just had a big win. Hakeem Dawood who wants to be that guy and obviously has a chance to prove that he can be that guy once again here tonight. Oh, that's a good kick, but now... Oh! Lawler and Covington next to Oh, there we go, there it is, Hakeem. Nice knees to the body, nice elbow. Ooh. Ooh. Lead the body by Hakeem. Just over three minutes now to go. And he is back again, William the Nightmare Knight, 32 years old from Connecticut. Remember last year, Haredim Aljabek was his opponent. It was a third round TKO for William Knight. Another level change by Brundage. Is out. Wow. Wow. That happened quickly for William Now You can see the power in those hands and elbows. It lands right on the side. Look at his body start to change here after the second one. Look, you see his legs start to split. Then the level starts to look right there. That's when you see that he's hurt bad. He's on a single leg and now he's just hurt. Now he's just surviving. And look at when the right arm goes limp, the fight's already over. I mean, fight's already done here. His arm's going limp. Herb Dean jumps in and finishes the fight, but elbow, look at his knee start to buckle. The equilibrium's off center now. And now watch the right arm drop, match is over. Match is over, Herb Dean sees it, stops the fight. Big win by William Knight. I mean, he was very close to getting finished early in the first round, and then to get a finish like that, very impressive.